Hello everyone and welcome to Cage Face. This is like a detective <laughs> type game, at least that's what I think. Like you are a cryptid investigator and you go like, oh, a cave fa cage face. I, I need to get this guy. He's putting cocks in his cage face. <laughs> the Blackstone Mines, which was closed back in the 1800s, had just recently been reopened. It has become home to horrible tragedy just this week. Two teenagers who have yet to be identified snuck into the mines to engage in vandalism. When one was killed and the other was hospitalized by a as of yet unknown illness, local police are unsure whether this was accidental or if foul play was involved. But the incident has halted the mine reopening. We might just have to close it up again, the mine supervisor said to an interview. Multiple stab wounds to the body, best massing a impl implement similar to pickaxes, signs of damage to the lungs, fitting poisonous as well as evidence of symptoms beforehand. Though bizarrely no traces of chemicals was found in the body. We don't put we don't put no chemicals in the body. I regret the things I did when I was young, and as I become old and gray, I still seek an answer to what I've done. I don't think the emptiness in my heart will ever feel full if I don't pay for what I did. Okay, that's a bit weird. You know that you would think that would work. Day one, got a new case recently. A woman came to my office looking for, looking distraught, beginning begging me to help find her grandpa. Apparently, he's been missing for three months, and the cops has dropped their shots as they usually do. She was getting desperate, so she decided to hire me. It's always nice to be someone's last resort, cause they pay the most. I normally don't take cases like this. It's pretty run of the mill, and I've had my. Feel of breaking bad news to people, but once he told me how much he was willing to drop for this, well, I couldn't say no. It's a lot of money. Finally managed to get into the grandfather's home. The trouble was worth it, though, because I managed to find a box he kept hidden deep in his wardrobe. It had a lot of odd stuff in it. A newspaper, some documents, and a VHS tape that you definitely couldn't just pick up without some credentials. I have no idea how he managed to get a hold of half these things. Either he has friends in high places, or friends in low places to know how to get things they shouldn't have. There was also some note that Matt's his handwriting and a- Oh! And a wooden box with a combo lock. The most bizarre thing though was a stra- A strange humanoid creature. Large in stature with some sick contraption on the forehead. This that's definitely helped me out. I feel it definitely brought up more questions than it answered. I have to keep looking. Okay. Did, did I explore everything? Oh wait, ain't downpour it. Pour it. Uh, I think there's a game called Down Downpour, actually. You know what? Uh, you know what? I don't even know the game. I, I, I had to learn some shit before I started uh, jumping into hard mode. So, let's start with the events that happened in the mine, if you feel you're able to. Me and my bud has just graduated from high school, and we was going to be leaving for college. We couldn't wait, we finally got to leave the dump of a town once and for all, but we also kind of wanted, wanted to leave our marks, you know? So, my friend knew about the shutdown mine that was reopening for use. The miners was going to work on it in a bit in the morning and take the rest of the day off. So we figured we can sneak in and tag the place. So the time came, but it turned out my flashlight was pretty old and faulty. My dad did hunting though, and he, he legit had a night vision scope. I figured he wouldn't notice it was gone. When I got to the mine, my friend was, wasn't there. I figured he'd just, he'd just gone in without me is all. Turns out I was right. He used a ladder to get over some big metal gate. I went in the same way he did and started looking for him. Oh, good. Uh, that's a lot of instructions. To all mine restoration workers, I want it to be perfectly clear what we are doing here. This comes straight from the supervisor, so make sure you commit all this to memory. Our current job is to install new lighting fixtures, fit new doors, 
and the electric systems, put up signs marking any dangerous areas and prepare for cleaning, and reopening those closed tunnels. You might notice some items left here from when the mine was opened back in 1800s. Supervisor made it clear if it's not in the way, leave it alone. We'd be taking care of those items later, so don't get any funny ideas. Can I leave? Okay, so I probably want to head to the storage area first, then the fuel storage, then there's probably a generator in the west area. Then, wait, there's also an east area. Okay, well, at least that's how I'm thinking about it. How, how do I put it on? Oh, okay. No one reads these, the reports around here, so I put this up here. After putting away the jerry can, I noticed the center support frame snapped and the ceiling could come down any moment. So to make sure no one wanders in here and gets badly injured, I barred the door. If there's anything you would keep in the storage room, just wait until we properly inspected and secured it. Well, fuck me. Collecting supplies to help remove the debris from the collapsed tunnel. I know the supervisor said otherwise, but I still think we should just get some proper gauge to test if there's any toxic, toxic gases around it. You can never be too careful with these old mines. Anyone got a canary? Holy shit, he did. I don't know what the hell did this to him, but I'm not about to sit out and find out. We had a door is blocking me though, how am I going to get out? Maybe you have something that can help me. Stop. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, fucker. Oh. Well, he does have something. Okay, I thought that was... I thought there was a creature, man. <laughs> okay. I need to get the fuck out of here. I have the key. How do I use the key? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <gasps> it's the Mining 69 from Scooby Doo. Did he just fucking teleport out of here? I think he might have teleported. I do be hallucinating. Do note that the generator is mostly around in case we have a power outage. Need to get the front door open. It needs an 
needs an uh, ignition key and it uses special fuel and it won't take anything else. Both of those can be found in the fuel storage area. The code is Waning Crescent Full Noon. Look, I, I, I know how to solve this. But... Oh, sick. Okay, let's see if I'm a smarty or a dummy. Three, six, zero. Three, six, one. It's a waning crescent, then it's full. Maybe it's two. God, his fucking fingers. At that time, he decided to leave my ass alone. He just goes through the fucking walls. Okay. Okay, I found a moon chart that looks more like a clock. We'll just show it. So maybe that's it? Oh god, it's right here. That ain't nothing like this. Zero? He's probably right behind me. I think I got this shit. So long, good bitch. He just goes through the wall and it's like, well, what's the point then? 806. He's right fucking behind me. What? What? Oh. No, wait. Okay, so. Oh, wait. Uh, I, I picked the wrong one. Okay, look, I'm just worried he's gonna come up behind me any, any second because I hear his footsteps. I'm about to fucking die. Okay. One, two, three, four. Wait. One, two, three, four, five. Why is full five? That should be six. Yeah, you bitch. Okay, a waning crescent. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Don't put O. Oh wait, do put O because that's new. One, two, three, four, five. The one time I go like, it's a clock, and I do the, it's the clock answer. Eight, zero, five. Eight, zero, five. What the fuck? Yeah, he's, he's going to fucking kill me, I know. It's a waning crescent. Full. Then new. Right. Right. A waning crescent. Did I get full and new mixed up somehow? That's what I did. That's what I did. That's what I did. That's what I did. Eight, five, zero. No. He really do be staying over there. Eight five zero.
Police this week found the bodies of two men in the subway, identified as blank and blank. A correspondent for the precinct states that the MO is very similar to the death of blank. Of a still unidentified blank man on the blank freeway tunnel and we are all warning that this may be the sign of a serial killer despite the blank distance between the two incidents. Some sources have dubbed him as the tunnel man as speculation on these deaths has been mountain. He's the tunnel man. Oh wait, I have the hammer. Hope he doesn't walk through my box because if he does, I might die. Nice gawk, tunnel man. You bitch! Your mother sucks cock in hell. He's on my fucking right side because he just goes through walls. It doesn't matter what I do because he can just go through the wall. He's coming. You know, he be coming down a mountain when he comes. Hello. You little bitch. You little weak ass cock. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what any of that means. Is he really coming back? There he is. Weak ass. That's a Hank Hill ass. Please leave. He's just gonna let me, uh, fucking die in here. Okay, good, I actually managed to escape. Once I got the gate open, I got out, out of there as quickly as possible. I couldn't help but glance back, though, but that thing was gone, nowhere to be seen. I didn't feel like sticking around, so I just kept running and made my way home. It was late as hell in my pants, I had noticed I was gone, and it was said it was up and ready to chew me out for it. But they, but they forgot about that pretty quickly when they saw the state I was in. I was in shock at, and at some point I even started puking. I have to understand that the events you described are rather extraordinary. You might have been in shock or perhaps the mine had resi residual gas that affected your mind. Your monster could have just been a regular man. I wasn't imagining things, damn it. There was a damn monster in there. He walked through the walls. Listen, I understand that you was very stressed right now, but there are much more reasonable explanations for than that. I know you wouldn't believe me. There's some kind of weird creature in those mines. If you was all smart, telling people to stay far away from them. Where's well, the thing? <laughs> I need iron so I can make a iron dagger in RuneScape. Okay, everyone, thanks for watching. See you in the next one. I cannot find it. If there is one. Bye bye.